and I'm back and today I'm going to be showing you all of the prizes of this year's toughest events. So I gotta say, these prizes are definitely unique because there's many of them, but you have these like things with, g with gems, like that's new. So I'm gonna go through everything. So first we have this box, so I already opened that, but it literally gives you coins as much as I realized because I don't get any medals from it. I just got coins. Why? Coins, for me, are the most useless piece of trash ever because I almost never use them because they're... You don't really use them for anything, it's always just gems. And also, if you're wondering how to get coins if you have a problem with them, just grind uh, the stable quests and after a while... I mean, I was grinding them for like a few months and now I have so many coins that I never want to look at them again. So the next thing is the toughest chicken, so let me just put this ugly ass pen that I don't like. Oh my god, this is so cool how many the options there is. But like, there's four toughest chickens in total. But this is the one that you get from like, just, um, I guess, playing the event. And uh, it is maybe, I don't know, I don't think it's my favorite one. But it's pretty, I mean, it's, it's pretty basic. It's just a white chicken with a few feathers in toughest colors. So next thing is this toughest mystery item chest, and I have on my channel already opened a hundred of them, so I'll just show you a few of those right now on screen, but if you want to watch the full video, I'll just uh, put it in the description if you want to see the other prices that you can get. So in total in the event, I think you get three of these, so that's pretty cool. They don't, I don't think they did this before, so that's nice of them. The next thing is 20 gems. So 20 gems, that is not a lot of gems, that is barely anything, but... It's still gems, so I will never really complain, it's just kind of funny that it's only 20. So for this next thing, I actually had to literally do research, because the, the picture doesn't show up. Wh where is the picture of the toughest paint? I first thought that was a dragon skin, but it's not, it's actually a face paint. Look at that, it doesn't even show up here, so it's just... Hello? What? What the hell? It doesn't freak. <laughs> Uh, School of Dragons, please fix it. Please fix the paint. It is, uh, it is completely glitched. It doesn't work. Please fix it. Next thing, we have the owl. And also, after you get the owl, only 100 medals away, you get the owl tree that you can put it on. So that's convenient. And this is how that looks like. I decided to put it after my army of snowmen. It is pretty cute. I mean, the owl is quite nice. The tree looks quite good, too. Like, it's not too annoying, like... Also, why can't I remove this piece of crap? I don't want it in my farm. Why is it here? It's so funny. It just doesn't allow you to remove it, but whatever. So yeah, the owl, adorable. I really do like it, and I, I'll keep it in my farm. So this is the tier 2 mystery shard chest. And now I was really wondering what the hell is inside, and when I opened it was a bunch of those, I don't, I don't really remember what, but like those things for the blacksmith, for dragon tactics, not, doesn't, isn't really useful if you don't play Dragon Tactics, but if you do, I'm sure you'll appreciate this. And the next thing is in the hideout, and can we just for a second appreciate the hideout, that it changes color depending on the dragon you're riding, because I'm riding Dart right now, and you can see how the blue is for the eyes, the white is for the details, and like the black is for the majority of the color. I just love it. So this thing you can find like on this tab, which is kind of strange. I don't know, I kind of expected it to be somewhere more like with the furniture. So it was kind of hard to find, but yeah, it's here. And let's just see how it is. So this is actually quite pretty. I mean, I don't really have space for it. I, I really don't. But if I did have space, I would probably keep it because it's nice. It's pretty. It has a purple with yellow. I mean, I don't usually like the combination between purple and yellow, but for some reason here it works. And I mean, it's nice. It's a nice decorative piece. So for now, we again have the stupid glitch of, you know how you usually hover over this and it gives you the text? Well, for some reason, after some time, it just stops working. So now I can't really tell you how many gems this is. I'll do some research and I'll put the price here. Not really the price, the amount. So the next thing is another one of these chests. I've already said that. And now we have the hair. And now this is quite strange. So as you can see, there's one hair. This is the usual, like, you know, you get the female one. And I mean, this one is quite nice. It's not bad. The flowers, okay, they're a bit bright here. But yeah, when you put it on, it's not as bright. Okay, this kind of looks cool when you put it black. It's a nice contrast. But like, this is the thing I'm confused about. You also get the male one? 
like since when because usually you have you have the female viking and the male viking and like you get the, the hair depending on what gender you chose but this time they just gave you both so if this is a glitch don't remove it please keep it because i love it and i mean it you literally get two hairs so like i am not complaining and this one is very pretty like i really do like it but i'm still sticking with this one because i don't know i just fell in love with this one so the next thing i'm very excited about we get a kite like this thing where i i can't wait to see like, like oh my god they put kites even though i'm just confused why is there not toothless kite around here but i mean whatever i guess maybe it's somewhere else i just didn't find it yet oh my god oh my god oh my goodness look at that thing it is beautiful i love it Look at that, that is amazing! Like, oh my god, I love the kites. I hope, like, through the next years we get, like, every one of the kites because I want all of them. Can I have all of them? Can they be, I don't know, prizes? Can you, like, buy them for gems, maybe? Or be prizes in those, like, chests and stuff? Like, oh my god, I love it. It's so adorable. Even though, eh, I think this could use some texturing because it doesn't really feel like the... I think they should have just copied and pasted the texture from the farm and put it here, but whatever. I'll just put it there. Oh my god, I love it. I want all of them. You get another one of these chests, and now you get this weapon. Okay, so for the next thing, I am confused, because you have this weapon. Yeah, normal weapon, nothing that special. Oh, interesting. I... what? Why is... this is kind of, uh... I mean, it's definitely strange. It's not bad, it's not ugly, it's just I don't really care about weapons because you can't wear them on hoodies, so I kind of consider them useless. And also, when they're, like, it, they just float, kind of, and it doesn't... They're mostly glitched, I don't know. It's just not my, my thing. Here, for some reason, in the exchange menu, it says I don't own the item, even though I do. And maybe I accidentally exchanged it, but... Interesting. So this is not like the glitch where you can infinitely exchange things. I think they patch those up. I know people always ask me and I always do check if you can infinitely exchange an item, but I don't think that glitch is here anymore. Unfortunately, that's very, very sad. But this is just strange. So I still own it. I just can't exchange it. Okay. I have decided that it's better to just not ask questions and move on. Then we have more gems. Then this. We have a shield, uh, the names do not want to load on anything, I guess, so that's just lovely. Let's just see how this thing looks like. Uh, this, this is, I mean, it's okay, I mean, it's not what I like, I don't really like it, but I'm sure some people would appreciate, like, the detail, they did actually try, so I appreciate the effort. Next is the flight suit! Oh god, I love flight suits, please be good, I didn't actually check this i didn't want to i wanted to see my reaction here so i'm pretty sure this is like a speed stinger armor and what is this this is interesting okay let's see so um i like this i mean the colors i don't know how i feel about the colors but the design itself like look at that like this this headpiece i mean oh my god it's so cool I love that. And also the fact that you have this like on the legs as well. This is nice. They chose a good dragon to model this after because the Speed Stinger really has a very nice theme. And when you're flying as well, beautiful. And I'll just see from here. So I also love how, oh my god, they added like this little patch. Like you were making it and you had to patch it up. Like that's cute. That's nice cute detail and still the glitch. It actually feels like I've been pointing this out for ages. But when you're flying, you dive. You let go of the dive, your hands don't move back. You need to, like, press the other button. So I don't know if they'll ever fix it. But whatever, I guess. I don't really even <laughs> fly with flight suits. I just use them because they're pretty. And next we have the hybrid, which is the Zippo Rat. And this dragon, I feel like, really split the fandom. It seems like either people really like it or really don't. Or, I mean, some are neutral about it as well, so that's interesting. But I really do like it, I just wish this nose wasn't like this, even though some people said that they, they really do like the nose, so good for them, I guess. But just for this, I want to kind of put on this skin. 
going to just see how it looks. Oh my god, it's so bright in the wilderness. Oh, actually here it's fine. Ooh, that, that skin actually does look very pretty, even though I still like the colors more that I chose, but um, it's okay. So I'll leave a link for that video in the description if you want to see all the animations, because I won't be going through everything now. But yeah, that'll be pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video, and bye!